Muhammad. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? I'm good too. Yes. So Muhammad, congratulations on uh, getting the Carnegie Mellon admit. It's a really good school. So congratulations. Thank you. So um, when did you decide to uh, go to the US for your master's degree? Was it during your bachelor's degree or uh, while in school itself? So actually, I didn't plan to go. Uh, I didn't plan uh, to study in US uh, during my bachelor's. Actually, that uh, thought came into my mind when I was uh, working. So when I was working, I thought, okay, bachelor's is not enough, and uh, doing masters in US is better as compared to India. So then I I started thinking on that lines, and then I uh, thought of going for masters. So that is where where it started. Okay. So where did you do your bachelor's degree from? I did it from uh, Nelma University, Ahmedabad. And after that, uh, for how many years did you work? So currently, uh, my work ex is like four years. Oh. I'll be completing four years this June. Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, so when you decided to uh, do go to the US uh, and then you started preparing for GRE, at uh, what time did you? At what point of this journey did you come to J uh, Jambori? So I I came to Jambori uh, in 2014. So that is when I started thinking that okay, bachelor's is not enough and I should go for masters. And then I started looking for exams. And then uh, Jambori uh, came into my mind that okay, it's a very good school. I heard about uh, Jambori from uh, one of my friend. So he was also going. So he he told me that uh, Jambori is a very good very good. Uh, Institute and uh, they have very good faculties and you can uh, go there and uh, actually uh, while working preparing for exam is very difficult and I wanted to uh, focus uh, you know not lose focus on uh, GRE while while I'm working so uh, that's when uh, that's when I decided to go for them. So I understand that you you have been a student of our Noida Center, right? Yes, correct. That is correct. Can you elaborate a bit about your uh, experience in Jambori? Yeah, so uh, I uh, I joined for uh, GRE uh, at Jambori, and uh, uh, the initial uh, planning and uh, like on the day one itself, I got uh, uh, the planning and all like how uh, how uh, I'll be preparing for uh, the verbal and the quant uh, and the writing section. And then uh, uh, they introduced us to uh, the verbal faculty and the quant faculty. So from then on, uh, they gave the planning and all. So it went quite smooth after that. And in between, uh, they also arranged uh, some um, extra sessions wherein uh, they called uh, you know counselors who can uh, help us, uh, you know, who can tell us that what scores you can you should target if you want to go into, into that particular college. So that is how it all helped. All those things help a lot. So, uh, in I mean, you have been you are a working professional. So, when you were preparing for GRE, so uh, your you had lesser time as compared to college students. So, do you feel you know the Jambori course material, yes, the Jambori everything you know helped you kind of uh, get the maximum benefit out of your time? Yes. Yeah, so, Jambori actually helped me quite uh, to help me to save a lot of time. So actually, uh, by joining Jambori, I didn't spend much of the time on preparation. So they told me how much to prepare and how much effort should I put in. So I clearly identified uh, which is which are my weak points, and then I started working on those rather than you know uh, blindly going and uh, catching up everything. So that is how it helped. So I gave few mock exams, and from there, uh, my verbal faculty they told me that I should practice more on the blanks and all. And I should uh, start, uh, you know, reading uh, newspapers and all to get a grip on uh, different uh, areas. So, so that helped a lot actually. So, um, I mean, uh, if you have to pick, like, you know, a couple of things about Jamburi that you like most, you know, what would those be? Uh, uh, one thing I would mention is uh, the uh, uh, the organization. I mean, the way uh, it was planned. That uh, on day one you have to finish this. On day five, on day seven 
like that. I mean, the overall planning was too good, and it helped me a lot. I could able to see like by this time I should be done with this. I, by this time I should be done with this, and how much time I should spend and also. So the planning was too good, and also the material which was given. So that was uh, that was uh, excellent, and I would say uh, it was uh, ideal for uh, GRE preparation. Um, it was. Uh, uh, it was a made. It was made a little bit difficult so that uh, while writing Jerry, you would feel more comfortable. So, so that is what I like more. And apart from that, uh, I think uh, the online mock exams that helped a lot. So in Jamburi, uh, I also gave um, uh, mock exams, uh, which is uh, the the environment is similar to how it will be in actual Jerry. So that helped a lot. So. Uh, I gave uh, I gave two three uh, exams and I also got to I also got familiar with how the exam conditions in all would be so that helped a lot. So you uh, ended up with a GRE score of three twenty five, right? Yeah, it was it was uh, above bar. So three twenty was what I uh, what I was targeting initially, and uh, I think three twenty five was uh, definitely better. Okay. Uh, Yes, that is correct. That is correct. So, so what has been your experience uh, in that? And do you think you know that for a working so, professional like you, you know, it's it's helpful to take uh, take the admissions counselling service? Yeah, actually, it is uh, definitely helpful to take uh, counselling service. So, I was a lot a lot confused after getting this score that what colleges should apply and. Uh, and there were tens or twenties of colleges which I had in mind, so so that's where Jamburi came in, and uh, based on my work ex, based on my college score, based on my GRE score, they helped me sorted out everything. They told me that this is, these are the colleges which are which are you know ambitious for me. These are moderate colleges and these are the safe colleges. So this so they gave me a list which was uh, you know very uh, suitable for me. And that is how it helped. And uh, not just giving me the list, but after that, preparing for each and every individual college, like what sort of uh, statement of purpose should I write, what sort of recommendation letter should I write, and how should I prepare my CV and all. So that was quite helpful. So I, I would say that uh, getting a GRE score was like 50% uh, of the job done, and uh, rest of the job was done by admission counseling. So. I am very thankful to the admission counselling team as well. So is uh, Carnegie Mellon, uh, you know, is, uh, was one of your dream colleges or were you applying for more ambitious colleges? Yeah, so Carnegie Mellon and Cornell were uh, uh, one of my dream colleges and uh, yeah, UIUC was there, University of Illinois uh, at Urbana campaign. So that was, uh, uh, that was obviously ambitious. So yeah, but I was happy to get uh, admits from both uh, Carnegie Mellon and Cornell. Oh, so you got uh, both Carnegie Mellon and Cornell. Yes, yes. So for EC course, so yeah. So my admission counselor also told that uh, it's very difficult to get into uh, you know core core EC uh, uh, course for, from such from such colleges. So right. I think. Uh, yeah, so it was a lot of hard work which helped me achieve this. So, uh, which where will you be going to, Cornell or Carnegie? Yeah, I'll be joining Cornell. Okay, that's great. That's great. And you know, actually, very few Cornell gives out very few MS admissions offers for ECE. So, uh, you know, especially to Indian students. So that's definitely an accomplishment. Yes. Thanks. So I mean, uh, so if you have to give any advice to uh, students who are now just starting out uh, to think about doing MS abroad or thinking about GRE preparation, what advice will you give them? I think I will tell them that uh, they should, uh, you know, first figure out which field you want to go into and which colleges they have in mind, and they should get an they should have a target like. This this is this is the course I, which I want to pursue. This is the college which I want to go into, and this is the GRE score which requires, uh, which is required for me to get into. And then they should you know start uh, focusing on how to achieve that score. 
So they should plan it well. That is what I would like to say. And that is where uh, Jambori will help a lot, uh, planning and pre preparing, preparing to achieve that. So, so, uh, so going forward, uh, uh, I mean, as your friend uh, suggested uh, Jambori to you, would you also be in a position to recommend Jambori to your friends? Yes, sure, sure. So I actually told a lot of my friends that uh, uh, if you are planning for uh, GRE and uh, you know, for masters in US, then Jambul is a place where you should go. Alright, so uh, thank you so much. Uh, wish you the very best of luck. Uh, stay in touch with us once you are in contact. Thank you, thanks a lot. So, um, I mean, it's always sure, good, sure. To, good to stay in touch with students. And uh, anytime you are in Delhi, do come and visit us. Uh, Alright, Mohammed, thank you so much. Thanks a lot, thanks a lot.